Okay, girls. All right, let's talk about Once Upon a Time's Chapter 2's Girls Collection. I'm going to start with um, a couple of my favorite pieces that mix and match great together. To me, these are so classic Matilda Jane. We're going to start with this piece. There's a baby piece, just like this one. So I've already talked to you all about the detail in this. But with these ruffles from this month, this is called the Caterpillar Big Ruffle. Um, and it's just, it's adorable. This to me, these colors in this ruffle and the detail here is just so classic, gorgeous Matilda Jane with these buttons and rick rack and ruffle or in bow right down the front. Um, also looking great with this pant is this dress. And it is just super simple with this large stripe on the top, this mustard polka dot in the middle with this brown floral print. Also looking great with this dress is this mustard pant. This pant to me is just such a staple for the fall. This is called the Pebbles Legging. The legging on the bottom, the ankle of this legging, is gathered just like the Be Brave leggings from last month. And it looks great. These leggings look amazing under so many pieces. Will look great under boots. Looks great with this dress. A couple other pieces that I think it just looks great with is this quiet, or sorry, quite right dress layered underneath. Just super simple and cute. And then a great top to go with these pants. There's a couple of them, but this fun green asymmetrical top called the Likely Story Indeed tunic. It breaks up all this green and blue that's in the top and adds a little pop of color with these mustard leggings couple of other great just staple tee tops, um, easy to wear tee type tops from this collection is the make uh, glimmer tunic and it says magic oh wait yeah magic wonder the flowers are three bead on this top the lettering has a yellow glitter on it and then also another great staple staple tee top is the Dyna tee. The Dyna tee is just our classic white knit with the blue ruched around the ruffles and then it's got that yellow mustard polka dot trim on the arm. I'm absolutely loving this top with the skirt. Another classic Matilda Jane piece. Oh, you can't see the skirt, can you? It's called the croquet skirt. Croquet is in Alice in Wonderland. They played croquet. Um, but just super cute, lots of detail, some mustard, lots of purples this month. I love this skirt with this top. It also looks great. The skirt also looks great with the Lunar Fable top. The peasant. <laughs> Everybody, including myself, and I put it on Kai today, is loving this peasant top. It has a great baby match and a great big sister match and goes through a 14, so it's going to be great through our tweens. It's called the Great Delight Tunic. And it looks beautiful, simple and awesome with our bright eye jeggings. And really bringing out the purple in it are the new binnies. Also looks great with the ruffles from last month. So lots of stuff goes with this great peasant top. There's a new hoodie this month for two through 14 that has the same, um, corduroy fabric as the baby hoodie last month and then the lining of the hoodie is the purple schoolhouse. Cute and simple with two layers, a um, embroidered lace and a dot tool, a uh, Swiss dot tool on the bottom. Going down to dresses that are new for this month, I've already highlighted some of these, but the just a very nice simple hourglass lap tunic in this gorgeous blue or greenish blue that's the same as that baby cardigan. And then the last two dresses I want to highlight are both gorgeous and amazing. This is called the, I should know this, Little Miss Alice dress. The Little Miss Alice dress is a long sleeve version of our American Beauty or Cherry Pie with four layers of ruffles. So it's got a great twirl, it lies beautifully, and it's long sleeve. Look gorgeous with these binnies and will look gorgeous with the ruffles as well as any of the tights this month. Look beautiful with these tights. So super fun 
and cute. I just, I love this dress. So soft, so nice, and has a great mom match to it. And then finally, this is the something curtain, behind the curtain tunic that has these leaves and acorns that I'm just, I love all the detail in the print here. The bow, two pockets, Kylie's gonna love it because the pockets. It is cut like last year's popsicle tunic, except for that there's no buttons down the back. And of course, it's long sleeves. The wrist of the sleeve is gathered like the Lunar Fable tee. And it looks adorable with the hidden cottage binnies from last month. Also looks great with the bow legging from last month. And the Be Brave legging from last month will look great. That's mostly our girls collection. If anyone has any questions, oh wait, haha, <laughs> accessories. We have a new bow this month. This bow is like last month's. It's fabric um, with batting on the top and then a grow grain purple bow underneath it. And then our two new tights. The last thing I wanna point out to you on our tights this month is that the sizing has changed. Tights are available in size six to 12, 12 six to 12 months, 12 to 18 months, size two, size four to six, eight to 10, 12 to 14, and size 16. So order based off the pant size that you are currently wearing. Anyone has any questions, let me know. I'll try to get some tights on Kylie to see how they're fitting. Thanks ladies.